everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new here then do click the subscribe box um this video is a bit different because normally i do study like study videos or like lifestyle but today i am reviewing the james charles palette now this came in the post today so i'm really really excited to open it and use it even though it is going away as soon as i've used it due to the fact that it is a birthday present and if you are not aware my birthday is in a month i turned 17 this year i have a lot of eyeshadow palettes and i use the same colors all the freaking time so i'm going to create a look using some of these eyeshadows probably the warmer colors because i feel like that suits me more um yes i have dyed my hair today and my hair is still a bit wet so i'm gonna open the box because why not satisfying it's quite, i didn't expect it to be this big like it is quite big i didn't like I've never bought from Morphe, so I didn't, didn't expect the sizing, but it's quite a light. But let's open it, if I can open it. So you've got like the color, like title names, and then the color. Just, I, I'm so sad that I have to take this away. Uh, right, let's get on with testing out these are bad boy colours because I don't want it to go completely wrong but yes I'm going to give this video a cheeky thumbs up if you're a sister or you just want to be nice anyway um just to point out that I am not in any way shape or form a makeup artist or a beauty guru I have a lot to learn still and I kind of just go for the natural look on a day-to-day -day basis but yes let's go um I'm gonna start off with the just the just a basic white color which is the <laughs> shade canvas it's just basically a creamy color shade and i'm just gonna do that just to go over my eye and it kind of just hides my veins up like if i was going for an actual look which i'm not <laughs> this is definitely a shade it just hides your veins up because i have very very veiny eyes and yeah it kind of sets a kind of canvas <laughs> I'm next gonna go in with the colour the colour Mary. That is my best friend's name. Um but I am not sure what to expect with Morphe because I have first of all never bought from there. Second of all, James, I've never you know don't know what I was doing with that but this makeup brush was wet so that was not a good choice what was I thinking so I'm kind of just blending this colour on the outside because this one went completely pear shape and I'm gonna have to like sort it out so I'm just gonna sort this one out and I'll be back okay I think I'm done. Right, I'm just gonna put the mirror a bit back. <laughs> so um, next, I'm just gonna go in with in the corners of my eyes with the color Love That. So the color Love That is this burgundy shade, and then I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back in with a lighter color. We're jumping between those two colors which is the sister shade and the sister and not the si and the, so we've got shade sister and then the shade um literally and literally is just a mood for me it's probably going really pear shaped but i don't care anymore 
and then what I do is I go back in with sort of a white colour and then like white my eyelids a bit more. Yeah. So I just take a sort of a blending brush and just go in with the colour, the shade Spooky, because it's just a pure white and what I do is I just basically make sure my crease is a bit blended more and I just whiten my eyelid a bit more so that when the glitter shade goes on it doesn't look really really bad. Yeah. So. The next shade I'm gonna go in with is shade Sister because we sisters. <laughs> what brush do I use is the question. So hopefully this shade is pigmented and it is pigmented, so yeah. Like, let me know what videos you wanna see because I'm completely ran out of ideas and I just, Suck. That's why I'm not a makeup artist, and that's why I'm not a full time YouTuber. Like, YouTube and like education get so meddled up with each other. Like, sometimes I'll do YouTube videos and then I'll get like behind in school, and then sometimes I like do no YouTube videos, and then YouTube will just get like really behind, and then like I'll do subscribers. Like, I'm so happy that I have been gaining subscribers lately. Like, thank you. Welcome. I don't have a name for you. Like, I don't even know what to call you, like, everyone that watches my videos. Like, okay, it hasn't turned out that bad. I'm, I don't really want to, I don't really want to, like, go um, I'm gonna go back in with this colour because this colour is like absolute babe and then I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna and then I'm gonna get back to you once I've added eyeliner Eyeliner, mascara, maybe some eyelashes. I'm not too sure, but I'm just so the conclusion of this I'm just gonna move that out of the way is I definitely think that I'm happy that I've bought it um, Basically what I did is I just tidied up my eyeshadow did the eyeliner and That was, and then I put some mascara on I didn't really want to use eye, my eyelashes because like they're the only ones I have and I kind of I'm holding on to them just a bit longer but I definitely think I'm more of like gonna use the sort of warmer tones and I think if I wore something different or like I was going to somewhere like like if I if I was just gonna go out now like I definitely would go out with this eyeshadow on like I don't have a problem with that but I think like the warmer tones like kind of these colors like the purples yeah and then the warmer tones definitely I'm gonna use and definitely this palette is definitely going to take over my life and i'm going to use it a lot um i bought it so i'm gonna like test some of the pigment because some people like shouldn't do that but some people are saying that some of the pigment is like really really like bad so i'm gonna trust the pigment on the shade wig which is this goldy tone so um there is pigment on this so i'm just gonna like okay the pigment sort of dies so it's like really on my finger but this sort of dies onto my like not really much my um arm and then i'm gonna try the cut artistry because i basically tried this one out and it kind of failed so it, there is pigment on my finger, but as soon as it goes onto my arm, it kind of just dies. So it's kind of, you can kind of see it here. It's kind of really pale. And I don't think my camera is gonna like pick it up. I do hope you did enjoy the video and I will see you all next week with uh, another video. Bye. Feeling in the sunrise, even in the nighttime.
hard to adjust though